Hello, hello, and welcome to another update video about gold. Gold is getting quite interesting now because um, as you might remember from previous videos, we have been looking for an A, B, C correction here in a wave two. Um, it hit our trend reversal area, the 50% FIP retracement here at 1937. I think touched it a couple of times and is now bouncing. Um, it broke above the wave four resistance. It didn't sustain there, but it broke. I mean, I cannot rule out that this is still the wave four in the making, but I see that as a um, lesser likely path right now. Um, we have a possible five wave move down complete in the C wave, which is good to see. So because this is all, you know, overall embedded in a wave two, I would expect a third wave rally can unfold no problem. Um, this will obviously take a bit of time. It's not gonna go up in a straight line, but honestly, if the wave two is in, we should see a very bullish second half of the year in the gold market. I am not ruling out that we get another low, so we could definitely get another low. What I'm saying is we have a possible impulse to the upside of the lows. Um, or rather leading diagonal, but I can count a five wave move up. It's possible to either place the wave one here or to put it here. And the first deeper retracement will basically give us more clarity. What is important, of course, now that in any wave two pullback, which is due at some point, we do not break below 1938, because if we do, then it will lead to another low and that would not necessarily be bearish it would just extend the overall correction a little bit more. At the moment, again, I can count a possible five wave move up. We need to see now three waves down. And for me, gold now needs to show that it can rally in this possible third wave that could take us eventually to $2,300, $2,400 over the coming months maybe. And it just needs to give us now this structure. Wave one could be nearly complete, then a wave two pullback. I don't have a confirmed top in place yet for wave one, but if we get a wave two pullback, afterwards a third wave, a fourth and a fifth. If these five waves up are complete, that would give us even more clarity, and then three waves down would give us even more clarity, but that will take weeks to play out. But it will prepare us, if we see this structure of the lows, it will prepare us for that heart of a third wave rally. Again, you, you will notice that I don't wanna make you too excited about a possible low in place because it is very early days. And this could also still be bearish. Yeah, I mean, it could still lead to an overall new bear market low below the September, October lows 2022. However, as long as we're holding bullish support, which is here at 1865, I'm focused on the upside and even if it's bearish my view is that this is an opportunity in the gold market that shouldn't be ignored at least yeah um but yeah this is now getting interesting so if we i mean i can give you a support area now for a possible wave too it's just that be aware i don't have a confirmed top in place so if we push a little higher then this support area needs to be adjusted this is standard Fibonacci support for a wave two. And we have here typically the standard support is between the 50% FIP level at 1964 and the 78.6 FIP level at 1948, which means if it goes below that level, it will already shift probabilities towards another low even, but that additional low could just still be part of the overall bullish scenario. So yeah, looking forward to how gold um, decides in the next few weeks. My view is that we have definitely good chances for a bullish outcome here, but obviously the condition is that the levels that I just mentioned need to be defended by the bulls. Yeah, we cannot have um, a break below 1865. That would indeed be quite bearish. And in the short term, if this is supposed to be something, then the 1948 level should hold. 
Okay, that's my update about gold. I hope you liked the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye bye. Thank you.